So I've got to get to where? Map? To the market. So how am I going to get there? Okay, and then from the market, uh, the old quarter is another way in. So if I go through the docks, I can get to the old quarter and then maybe get to the stone market. Is that what I'm seeing here? No, probably not because there's a line here, so I'm not sure. Anyways, we'll go head towards the gate and see what's uh, what's over there. I should probably buy a few things, though. Something in particular you're looking for? The name's Thomas, if the sir needs anything. We hope you find everything you need with this quarantine. We're cut off from our regular suppliers for a while. How do I we buy something? special tonight, sir? Oh, there we go. I just wasn't clicking on it correctly. Let's get 10 more water arrows, which will put me up to 12. Yes. That seems like a good use of money. I may have spent or you may have used those a little too um, wildly in the last mission because it seems like they're not just going to give me more. I'm going to actually have to get cash in order to get more. Okay, so let's see if we just nudge by here. Sneak around. Can I get into this building? No. So I kind of want to steal all that stuff there. Can I just put that out? Okay, and then let's save first. But I just want to see what happens if I just grab some of the stuff, seeing as he can't see me. So south quarter saved. If I just come over here and go ding. Ding, ding, my shinies. Nice. Doesn't even notice that they're getting swiped right off his table. Pull, pull, go around. Go around the corner. There we go. Wasn't too hard, was it? Commoner, commoner, not too concerned about them. Oh. There's a guard there. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, another guardsman. Uh, V, 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 V. Hide this body in here. No, no, just hide the hide the body. Just hide it. Hide it. Hide it. Hide it. There we go. Nope. Oh. Don't come over here. What? Funny noises around here. I squat the rat and he heard it. Shoot. And that commoner's coming. Hmm. Hello? Are you Cappy? He's testing me. Jeez. Hmm. Nothing. Whatever I heard must have been. Oh, can I pickpocket that guy? Looks like he's got a shiny on his belt. I do like shinies. It's in there. Oh, this must be the docks. Check my map. Yeah, this would be the area where I just tossed the body. So the docks must be in there. But it doesn't look like I can enter there. Now, how am I going to get to this guard without being seen? Oh, it was nothing. Wish I had something to throw so he could he hear it and then come over into the darkness. Oh, 
Oh, oh, what? It was nothing. Maybe it'll do it again. Go, 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 go. I gotta try and get up behind him before someone sees me knock him out. Go, go, go. I figured it was nothing. I probably just imagined it. Got him. Got him. Got him. Pick up the body. Pick up the body. Quick. Run. Run, 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 run. You see nothing. Hide. There we go. It was a guard. Shoot. Okay. Luckily, he is blind. So we're gonna run over here now. And now that I've cleared out these bodies, I shouldn't have to worry about anyone seeing me pick this lock, except for this guy. Man, this is not easy trying to open up a door. What's in here? Well, there's a well. Oh, I guess this is another spot where I could hide someone. Okay, he's gone. So we're gonna quickly try and pick this lock. Go, 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 go. There it is. One more. Awesome. And close the door behind me. Now, what can I do in here? This just looks like someone's home. Um, some loot. So I guess these are just random areas where, oh, what was that? These just look like random areas where I can go in and steal from people in order to get more money. Um, oh, to get more items. Or, you know, I could just get more items from the home. Neat. Oh, was there... There's a window here all along. Although I don't think I could have jumped up from there. Okay. Let's head upstairs and see what's up there. For a second there, I thought I could highlight the, uh, the torch. Alright. Up the stairs we do go. I think I hear someone. I think I definitely hear footsteps. Oh, oh. I'm gonna save. I'm I'm gonna stop saving so much eventually, but right now I'm just sort of like I don't know what's gonna happen if I try something, so I just wanna make sure that I don't mess up the game or mess up my file or not even mess up my file, but just have to restart the whole level over something dumb. All right, so he's knocked out. What else we got in here? We got health pot. Um, another nice piece of loot. Nothing in these cabinets. Put out that. I think that's it. So about a hundred dollars. So enough for a water arrow. Um, but quite a good bunch of items. I think two health pots and a flash bomb in here. It's not bad. I don't know if it was worth all the effort of knocking out those two guards. Oh, what was this way? And yeah, so rather than lockpick that door, I could have went around and jumped in through that window. And that way I wouldn't have had to lockpick. Oh, oh, guard, guard. Oh, no. He's going to catch me. He's going to catch me. Okay, darkness. We're good. Now we're gonna head back down and I guess knock him out. Or at least try. Oh, he's kinda... Oh no, there's another person coming. Now that guy shouldn't have a problem with me though. 
we should have no problems with each other. It's weird conserving water arrows, because like when I was playing before in the last level, I would have just um, shot out all these torches, so I would have been perfectly safe. Okay, we're just going to run. It's going to be easier than trying to sneak around. Ooh, loot. I do like me some shinies. How do I pickpocket? Oh, oh. Hey, how are things? Don't mind the guy creeping behind you. And there's a guard there, so I'm gonna leave that alone. Alright, let's just check over here and see what's uh what's going on with the entrance to the stone. Oh. Yeah, there there's a bunch of guys there. Um again, not sure how to handle this. So let's try shooting arrows from the darkness and see what happens. Or better yet, maybe I should just walk up and talk to them. Ah, it seems like a bad idea. Looks like Lady Elizabeth is here with a couple of thugs. Um, so that worked, but left me with one arrow remaining, so that's not so great. Um, uh, shoot. Hmm. I guess that was one way to handle it. I could have probably tried going up and talking to them, but... Oh, you know what I could have done, is I could have just used a flash bomb and tried to run by them. Uh, where'd her body go? Was there... There was a body right there. And now it's gone. So did she take off, or...? Huh. What's in here? Uh, nothing? Well, that's loot. Uh, M, soon the opal will be mine. The fence told us the thief's name is, uh, Garrett, and that he'll try for stone market. By my men have, but my men have barricaded the gate and are ready for him. When I return to the castle of Ruth, uh, castle of Ruthford with the opal, I'll watch Julian and Ember suffer for a time anyway. Later I'll poison them. Never leave loose ends, Lady E. Huh. Really wondering whether or not she's dead or she wandered off now. She's probably dead. Body probably just glitched or something. So now I can head over here and go into the stone market and try and sell the opal. Yeah. So in here. But I think this is enough for tonight. Um make one more save next time we'll head into the market and try and get this opal sold I don't know I'm still trying to figure out this game it's it's really interesting but I'm trying to figure out exactly the best ways to handle situations um, yeah it's a little bit of trial and error right now but super fun anyways for now though this is uh, Tolhi signing out later guys